Hello YouTubers, beer geeks, and beer hounds alike. Bill here, we're gonna do a beer review. All right. This one is by Sol, S-O-L, and it's their Chilada beer. And um, let's see. Didn't find my glasses, be right back. Oakley dokely, I'm back. All right. <clears throat> Beer with natural flavors and artificial color. Okay. It says uh, a flavorful and refreshing mix of soul beer with natural tomato spice and lime flavor. And this comes in at. Well, it's from Mexico. I'm looking for the ABV 3.5 really light so I've never had this before I've seen it in the stores but never went for it but it kind of had the hankering for something like that so I went ahead and grabbed it it's a big 24 ounce uh, tall boy can uh, it's like three bucks or something at the local 7-eleven so uh, let's handle it So, yeah, pretty foamy. It's kind of frothy a little bit. It's uh, not super tight though, but I can tell it's probably gonna dissipate fairly quick, but it's, it's hanging in there a little bit. And it's a pretty hazy, kind of like pinkish, uh, orangey color. I'm not really sure what color that is. Orange, magenta, kind of. It's like a copper orange pink weird color. I'm not sure. I'm surprised the head's still hanging around though. Um yeah. No Nat wanted some of the beer. Alright, let's get an aroma test. Cheers. It smells like chilada. Yeah. It's what if tomato chilada is what it pretty much smells like. About all I'm getting, tomato, you know. Let's try it. Cheers. Mmm. Yum. That's pretty tasty. <laughs> it's kind of yummy. It's got some good fizziness on the tongue. You can taste the tomatoes, the chilada. doesn't taste like beer it tastes like carbonated chilada but kind of a thinner mouthfeel has like medium kind of mouth mouthfeel yum I love tomatoes and I, I like chilada so this is it's kind of tasty right now it's got that kind of you know Almost like spaghetti kind of taste. Get out of here, you little gnat. All right, you wanna play? Hold on a second. All right, we're ready now. Bring it on. Come on. All right, so, of course it's only three and a half percent. There's no booziness. I mean, I, this is something I wouldn't want to be drink drink every day, but like every once in a while, I get the hankering. For, I guess it's probably for the tomato part, and uh, this would definitely handle that. Um, it's pretty tasty, actually. I'm enjoying this. Yum, I like it. So I'm gonna sip out for a while and enjoy this, and um, I'll be right back. Alrighty, I'm back. 
Um, it's leaving some complacent on the glass actually there. Uh, this stuff's pretty good actually. It's not overly spicy. There's some definitely some spices coming through. And um, but it's just the just the right amount. Ralph. Sorry about that. Um, I like it. I like I had the hankering for this and it totally cured that. And I think uh, there's other brands of you know chalada beer, but I think this might be one of the better ones. Excuse me. So um, I think it's tasty. I think they made uh, you know a really good version of this uh, you know chalada beer. I think they did a good job on it. I think it's probably one of the better ones. Um, let me know if you think it is, if you've ever had it. But I think it is. I think they did a really good job on it. So I'm gonna swill it one more time. We'll wrap it up. Cheers. Yeah, yum. You know, kind of like chalada tomato type deal. Mmm. Did a good balance of beer and chalada, but it just you know, it's got that kind of food quality almost to it, like almost like a V8 you know juice. Really good. But it's light enough mouthfeel and drinkability to where you're still kind of like drinking beer, you know. So with that said, um, I'm going to give this puppy like a 3.6. I think it's that good. So uh, 3.6 it is. That's my story. I'm going to stick with that on the SOL Chilada beer. It's very tasty. Yummy. You know, you get, you get the cravings for certain things. And this definitely uh, cured that craving. And I'm glad I picked it up because tastes good so y'all have a great day night wherever you're at cheers you know bell like subscribe that's the deal see ya later